Pope Francis appoints women to synod of bishops. Benedict XVI is terrified by this Bergoglio's action. For the first time in the history of our Catholic Church, Pope Francis appointed on Saturday, February 6, a woman as under secretary of the Synod of Bishops, the French nun Natalie Beport, who will be accompanied in her position by Louis Marin de San Martin from Spain, as announced by the Vatican. This appointment has caused displeasure to Pope Emeritus Benedict XVI. European media report that the Pope Emeritus is horrified by the nomination of a woman to the Synod of Bishops. The Secretary General of the Synod, Cardinal Mario Gritch, gave an interview with the Holy See media where he stated, In recent synods, there has been an increase in the number of women who have participated as experts or auditors. With the appointment of Sister Natalie Bigport and her possibility to participate with the right to vote, a door was opened. Cardinal Grech added, According to statements by Linda Telford, a religious historian close to the Vatican, the measure announced by Francis regarding Natalie Bigport has produced a wave of criticism of the Roman pontiff. In her feminist language, she says, Benedict is terrified by the appointment of a woman to the synod and said that the Pope Emeritus is an old-fashioned priest who believes that women are for praying and reproducing and that their function is to stay at home and obey. Comments The fact that a woman participates in the Synod of Catholic Bishops for the first time in the history of the Church is something unusual, because this is a male group where the priesthood of Christ is continued. Let us remember how in the Last Supper not even the Virgin Mary was allowed to participate. This is why, in a synod, there is no room for women, much less this one who participates as a synod consultant. These modern reforms of Francis continue to plague the Catholic Church, and there is no one brave enough to contradict him, because his functions are dictatorial. Bergoglio does not admit correction. He feels He's a perfect man, and he only needs to say that he is God for us to understand that he is the Antichrist. The irregular nomination of a woman within the Church has made traditionalists uncomfortable, as well as Pope Emeritus Benedict XVI. The traditional Church is suffering more and more every day with the reforms of Jorge Mario Bergoglio an ultra-modern pope who is destroying the traditions of the Catholic Church while creating the new global religion of the Antichrist with the participation of the United Nations. It is unfortunate that Pope Emeritus Benedict XVI is obliged to remain silent in the face of Bergoglio's outrages. Let us pray, my brothers and sisters, because the Catholic Church is about to be shipwrecked in the boat of Judas, because it is no longer in the boat of Peter. If you like this video, please give us a like, subscribe to our channel, The Work of God, share on social networks, and do not forget to leave your valuable comments. Please tell us what you think about this new crazy decision of Jorge Mario Bergoglio. God bless you.